Hi. Um, I'm volunteering in the Erasmus Student Network. And two weeks ago, um, my successor, successor was found uh, for a PR manager in East Germany. And it was a really emotional moment for me because I now, like in two months, I have to give away my baby. Um, and not my baby, I took it already from somebody else two years ago. But I don't know, I raised it for like two years and um, I got so much passion about ESN and I two weeks ago I didn't knew what um, I'm gonna do in ESN and volunteering and it gave so much to me that I want to give something back and um, yeah two, two days after the voting I got uh, the exception for the Educate which is a training event for ESNs to become trainers and I'm super excited about it because maybe maybe it comes too late and I should have done it before my NB time to better facilitate some workshops. On the other hand, I might be possible to share all the knowledge I gained through the last two, well, three years in ESN. Because the before my national board time, I was local president for one year in ESN Tiruristan, my beloved home section and it gave me so much energy to volunteer in that. I never faced such passion before in something. I, I was willed to learn things to realize project within ESN and I never faced it for projects for myself. So for example, my Instagram account is shit. <laughs> Not shit, but I don't spend a lot of time on it. And uh, yeah, but I really spend time on improving the social media accounts of ESN Germany and ESN Tour Dresden. I created a new logo for my section because I want to change something. I want to, to change the, um, the picture of ESN in Tour Dresden. And I still want to. I still want to teach others how they can do it. And I... Yeah, I still want to keep on doing all the things. But somehow this social media and communication throughout communication journey has an end. Because I'm not anymore the communication manager. And I will miss my community. I will miss the other people around. Um... Uh, yeah, I wish all the luck to the, to the new communication manager and I definitely will stay in ESN because yeah, it gives me joy. It, um, I don't know how to describe it. I can meet so many people. And last year, the people I was in the board with were just amazing. They were funny, always there when needed. And at this point, I have to say, I'm, I'm crying really fast. And I cried already two weeks ago when I hadn't, when it was the moment for me to say something and to thank you or to, to thank the network, to thank um, my national board, and I couldn't. Because tears were running already for five minutes, and I said, fuck it, you can't even form a sentence now, so just give on the mic and leave it. I expressed myself through uh, the smaller flags for the national board. And... 
I would have loved to, like, I, I still keep on working with them. I take care of the national event some more. Um, but still, there's a, I don't know how to describe two years of experience and people and events and all the knowledge I gained. Um, I just can say I'm so thankful through the massive possibilities I, I got. Um, I never would have been here if ESN Tourism hadn't wouldn't have supported me in going to the events and they even support me in the educate training and I, and I really want to give something back and I and I hope I do. I don't you never know what you can do through other people. But you never you never know um how you inspire people. Um and I just want to this is my thank you video. Um because I think this network, this thing is so huge. And um, this is my way how to say thank you. <laughs> because I only see myself and I never know who's going to watch it. Um, <laughs> so you do a great job, even in your local section or in your country and supporting your national boards. <laughs> Um, more people can do more stuff. That's what I realized in the last two years. I have faced many one-man shows and still it was amazing. And we tried to manage as many one-man shows as we can, as we could. And maybe also the ESN 30 years, like ESN Germany is getting uh, 30 years now and it's amazing how how long this network already is working with exchange students and still growing we are getting more and more volunteers people being so motivated um to join the network and i'm so proud of them um to meet these little people <laughs> i don't know how to say this small volunteers and seeing how they how they grow in ESN and where they where they travel when they are in their ESN career let's say um, I don't want to talk too much because it makes me cry <laughs> but thank you thank you for all the the loves for all the jokes for all the memes for for the fun and uh, have to see you soon somewhere this is just the one take it was the first and last take i will take i won't cut it and yeah thank you very much